This video lecture I'm going to discuss about how to install PowerShell 7.5 bomb on Windows 11 operating system. So first here to download the software in Google search box right there PowerShell download. Then you can go Microsoft.com site. And uh, here you need to click on this download PowerShell. So installing PowerShell on Windows. And here the GitHub site that's open. This is the version, latest version is there. Now, if you scroll down, here you can see different PowerShell are available. This is for CM here, Linux operating system. And uh, here, this is for Windows. So, Windows here, you can see ARM and uh, this pin 64 bit. So, PowerShell, Windows 64 MSI file, zip file, and here, exe file is there. You can download anyone. So, I'm using Windows 64 bit so that downloading this software. And this here, if you are using 32-bit, you can download this software. See, PowerShell 7.5.1, that's downloaded. Let's click on this showing folder. So, this is the software is there. So, you need to double-click on this MSI file. Now here, welcome to PowerShell 7 set of wizard. Let's click on next. So this is the location where PowerShell is going to install. Let's click on next. Here, this is for context menu. Let's click on next. This is for update and this is recommended. So let's click on next. And now you need to click on this install button. And now this come from Microsoft Corporation. Let's click on yes button. And uh, here you can see this here. PowerShell is now installing inside the Windows 11 operating system. Installing PowerShell 7, 64 bit. Now you can see installation completed successfully. If you want, then you can launch from there. Let's click on finish and now opening the command prompt. Command prompt and this place if I write pwsh then minus minus version. Then you can see PowerShell 7.5.1 that is just installed. And if I write there on search box PowerShell, so write there PowerShell, then you can see this is the PowerShell 7 open and uh, this here you can see powershell 7.5 ps that's come there let's print to hello world so for this one writing write minus host and insert the double quote writing there hello world press enter so hello world that's display so this is how we can install latest version of this powershell on this windows machine so I hope guys this video is helpful for you. So now this video is over. So thanks for watching. See you next week. Thank you.